Hi everyone, it's June from Talk to Gap. So we've gotten a request from a senior center for a how to use Zoom tutorial. So today we're gonna cover that and show you all how it's done. So in case you don't know what Zoom is, it's an online group conferencing service. So we're gonna be covering the four basics today, which are how to create an account, how to download Zoom, how to join a meeting, and finally, how to make a meeting. Now, if anyone out there wants me to make a video tutorial like this on any other topic, please email me at talktogap at gmail.com and I'll be happy to do so. Anyway, moving on to the first topic is creating an account. The first thing you want to do is go to zoom.us, which is the address right here. And then you're going to click this big orange button that says sign up, it's free. Once you've done that, you're going to have to enter your date of birth. And this is, I'm pretty sure, to make sure you're over 18 years old. Anyway, let's just put some random birthday for now. We will say we were born in the 1900s, which makes us 120 years old, but also over the age of 18, which works fine. There we go. Now, you're going to want to enter your email address. So I'm going to enter the talk to gap. Oops. Talk to gap at gmail.com. This is something called a CAPTCHA code. So you want to read what the letters and numbers say here and then put it into this little box here. This is to make sure you're not a robot, which hopefully you aren't. Now you click the big sign up button and boom. It will say they've sent you an email to whatever email you signed up with. And what you have to do now is check your email, check to make sure it's from Zoom, and then click on the email. Okay, so once you check your email, you should have gotten an email that says, in big blue letters, activate your account. Once you click on that button, you'll be taken to screen just like this, where it'll ask you this question. Are you signing up on behalf of a school? For me, no, I am not. So I will click no, and then I will click continue. Okay, now we set up our personal information. We enter our first name. I'll just say talk the gap example. Enter our last name, which I'll just say example last name. Enter a password and I'll do some secret password. I recommend you do something that's easy to remember. And then we click continue. Okay, now it'll take you to some place called invite colleagues. If you know what you're doing here, you can do it on your own, but for the rest of us, let's just skip this step for now. And here we go. It will give you the option of starting your first test meeting. And if you want to do that, you can go ahead and click on it, which I'm going to do. Okay, now it's going to ask me to open zoom.us. Now, if you don't have Zoom, download it on your computer. What you're going to want to do is click this download and run Zoom button. And once you do that, I'm on Google Chrome and it will show up as a little icon right here. Now, if you click on this, if you're on a Mac, you'll just be taken to this screen and then you'll have to click through here. However, if you are on a PC, it might ask you something like, please confirm you want to download this or give permission to download this app and you'll click yes. And once you're, that, once you're done with that, Zoom will be done. Now that we've figured out how to make a, an account and download the Zoom app on our computers, let's learn how to join a meeting. What you want to do is click on the Zoom app on your computer. Now, while you can just join a meeting by clicking this button here, some meeting hosts have it set up so you can't join a Zoom meeting unless you sign into your own account. So we're going to do that. Sign into your account you made earlier. Put in your password. And there you go. All you have to do now is click this giant blue join button and your meeting host will usually send you a meeting ID. For example, I'm just going to do 1234, 1234, 122. And then I will click join. That's it. Now, moving on to something a bit more difficult, which is how to create your own meeting. If you want to do that, on the previous screen, just click this big orange button that says new meeting. I'm going to do don't allow for now. And then I'll click join with computer audio. There we go. 
We are now in our Zoom meeting. If you want to invite other people, you go to Participants, and then you click this Invite button, which is here in the bottom right-hand corner. Now, you can send it by email, or you can do something called Copy Invite Link, which if you do this, it will copy a link to your clipboard. And if you want to paste this link, what you want to do is go to wherever you want to paste the link. And then if you're on a PC, on your keyboard, push Control V. Or if you're on a Mac, go to your keyboard and push Command V. And it will paste this long Zoom link. Now, if you send this link by email, for example, anyone who clicks on this link can now join your meeting. Also, please note, sometimes there will be a meeting password, which is here in the bottom right hand corner. If your meeting has a meeting password, you want to make sure that you share that with all of your participants so they can join your meeting. And once you're all done, you can click end meeting and meeting for all. And that's it. You're done. Thank you for watching. And make sure if you want me to make a tutorial just like this on any other topic, please send me an email at talktogap at gmail.com and I'll be happy to do so. Thank you and bye-bye.